The Quran is the word of God. Then it must not borrow its, past, its material from folklore, Jewish folklore and traditions. I might read one... Part. All right, just hold it. Uh, sir, I did say that you must put a question to Mr. Dillon. Yeah, well, I'm just saying... So can you put that in the form of a question? It might be a very valuable point and then I stop yes. you. This is, this is simply to disprove that the Quran is the, uh, and the word of God. I want to read this passage of scripture, uh, this passage from the Quran, 27, Surah 27 from verse 17. And there was gathered together unto Solomon his armies of jinn and humankind and of birds and they were set in battle order. <coughs> Sir, thank you. Now, what is the question to that? I said, please put that in the form of a question yes. and you'll get an answer. Right. If this is the word of God, why is it borrowed from the Jewish folklore? All right. I, I've got to read another passage. Here. No, no, I think your point is made that... Uh, I'm going to read the Jewish folklore to you. No, no, we, there's no time. We, your, your point is well made that why, if the Quran is God's word, why did God take yeah. from the Jewish folklore? Yeah, because the Jew, Jewish folklore predates, predates the... Islamic uh, advent. Yeah. Yes. No, thank you. Thank and you And I very got much. the Jewish folklore on me, yeah. No, no, I know about it. It's all right. Thank you very much. I can much. read it to you. Your question is well taken, please. You see, if you read the book of John, the last chapter, Gospel of St. John, chapter 21, verse 25, the last verse, it says, And there are also many other things that Jesus did, which if they were written one by one, I suppose that even the world itself could not contain the books that would be written. Amen. That means there will be so many books which are not here. Does it say that? That if the, all the books that were written about Jesus, if they were to be contained in a book, even the whole world can't contain them. So there could be other things which are not recorded here. That's what the implication is. Then you read in the uh, Old Testament, in the book of Joshua, is this not written in the book of Jasher? It says, uh, another place, another name. There are ten books. There are ten different books mentioned in the Bible which are not in the Bible. I, I wonder if you know them. Yes, uh, Mr. Mr. Dirat, the, the Jewish folklore is not scripture, it's legends, it's if, myth. If this was written in the book of Jasher, and if God Almighty has it copied from the book of Jasher, that means it must be something valuable. If God Almighty is having it copied from the book of Jasher... No, it's not uh, the God Almighty copied from the... Then who? It was Muhammad who copied it. <laughs> he pulverized it up. Right, thank you. Could I have the next question, please? Can I read it?